the authentic bus you have the the name and the number of the route in the front you have uh, <coughs> the bonnet here and engine underneath you have uh, the dark red uh, rims of course the banners on the side should we show off what those banners do yeah we could so the thing with this you, is you could change the the looks and the theme of the banners by flipping them around so it goes from explore london mm -hmm. to uh, a biscuit advert yeah. so uh, so then uh, then you get this uh, classic look and you can also change the license plates from uh, black ones to a white in the front and a yellow in the b in the back now you also notice that we have possibly my pun of the year with Brixton being the destination. You'll also notice the other stops on the way, including Yellow Bick Road and Brickadilly Circus. So, you know, for pun fans, this is definitely worth it. Mm -hmm. And also we managed to keep the nice curved uh, shape on the top of the roof, uh, following all the way to this, uh, this back corner and uh, on the, all the way uh, down to the back as well. And here the platform with the, the, the bar that you have. Mm -hmm. Very typical, and the, of course the names and the number there as well, and the same on the back. Okay. Now, should we so, yeah, lift should first? Yeah. yeah. Then you can lift the lid off of the top. Here's Lester. Shows uh, kind of the scale. And you also have some small details in here. Um, you have, for instance, a soda can in the front that's uh, Somebody's left behind there. And you have a, a newspaper in the back. One of those free newspapers. <laughs> and a lot of seats, of course. There's also a little hidden feature underneath one of the seats where you have a pink bubblegum. <laughs> so that's stuck there on the floor. Also, we can take the whole top off, like that. And then you can see the typical sideways turned sofas over the rear wheel arches. And um, here's all the seats as well. <coughs> Here in the front you have the drivers, the driver seat with the uh, handbrake and, uh, and the steering wheel. And you also have this sliding door. <coughs> and in the back, if we go there, you can see that there's a spiral staircase leading to the top floor. There's also a, a fire extinguisher and a l luggage compartment. And you have this used ticket box. And inside here, there's actually two used tickets. So, they they are in there. Also, you have a uh, umbrella in an umbrella stand that uh, Lester forgot. You know what he's like. <laughs> yeah. So we should also probably point out you can also pop if it has engine trouble. Yeah. That opens up too. Yeah. The front there. Now, are there any unique elements to this set that we haven't seen before? Uh, yeah, probably the wheel. This tire, uh, that's a new element we developed specially for this one. Mm -hmm. We have the terrain looking tire in the same, the same size, but uh, for this bus we figured we want a more um, street thread on it. Mm -hmm. So we developed this new, new tire, which will come in handy for many, many models. I am so sure of it, yes. Mm -hmm. um, many uh, MOCs. And another little note, so just thing I've noticed is the detail on some of the seats. Because, yeah. you know, these buses aren't all that new. Yeah. There are a couple of like scratches in the leather. You might be able to see it just there. Yeah. Can you see it? Some scuffs on the... Scuffs, that's the word. That's yeah. what I was looking for. Scuff. Yeah. Uh, and yes, you um, were mentioning that there's a reason why we have these letters on the license plate. Why is that? Oh, uh, it's the set number, of course, the, mm -hmm. the number, and then N NGW is uh, my initials. So I was uh, allowed to put that as a, as a license plate. And mm -hmm. also I've seen um, in England that there are uh, MGW license plates. Oh, there are? So, 
Yeah. <laughs> so that's so that's a kind of a cool thing. Yeah. It actually works together well. And also, mm. let's just put it back together just briefly. You do have. Push it. There you go. Mm -hmm. You do have the wing mirrors too. Yeah. And this one just came up like that. And we put that back on. Yeah. And this one can be turned either way. Mm -hmm. And it's uh, it fits nicely on top there. And also, I'm I'm happy with how we kind of have some studs showing, but also a clean kind of uh, look on it. So, like the like the real thing, it has some rivets here and there, and uh, and panels, and uh, that's what we we were aiming for with this as well. Get that uh, kind of panel like uh, feel. Now, obviously, we'll this is how it looks completed, but this is how it looks when you pick it up in the store. Oh man, here we go. That is the big box. What you'd be buying. And you can see. Yeah, it has all the nice features displayed on the back. You can see here it's uh, 10 centimeters wide by 34.5 centimeters long. Yeah, 1,686 pieces. There you go. So that is, in a nutshell, what you can look forward to with the new Lego Creator London Bus. 1,686 pieces. It's been a pleasure talking to you, yeah, learning nice. more about this. Mm. Um, and uh, I can't wait to get my hands on my very own. So, thanks for watching, and um, we'll see you next time.